Um, let's look at one of their wingers, Cassius Gleaves, one of the younger players in the side. Um, he's been in the side last year as well. Really special player, and you know it's a, it's a team packed with special players. But he, he's definitely one to look out for. He, he's um, obviously pretty quick, but uh, but he's an intelligent player as well. He'll look to come in and get involved. Yeah. The moves there and there's Cassius. This is the old idea of him there, giving him a one-on-one, -on -one. and I think it's just paid dividends because he is over under the posts. Well, we spoke about that footwork that he showed last week for his try. Magnificent turn of pace here. Oh, it's going to be a solo try. That is fantastic. Oh, they're 22. Good footwork. Stands up his opposite number. There's support there as well from Bryn Bradley, who finds that man, Cassius Cleese, who's been involved in absolutely everything brilliant. Going to go to the right as well, off the back two Cleves, and it's going to open up for the winger. Over on the right hand side, and Wellington could be in again. Opening up, and now Teague, he has Cleves, who's going to gather, and he's going to have a first half hat trick of pure class. and running the ball from nearly every, anywhere. Oh look, I mean, I think firstly, if you look at the scoreboard, Quinns are two points up at the moment, so they're clearly doing something right. I think they've just got to keep on doing what they're oh, doing. Oh, Chris, I've got to Cassius interrupt you here, because Cassius Cleves has just ripped through this X team like he did Gloucester last week. A great break there by Cleves. This is definitely one for the future. And it's in the hands of that danger man, Cassius Cleves, who breaks once again. He steps, he wheezes, he's got one man to beat. Can they stop him? No, they can't. What are you going to do to stop him? He, he's, frankly, when he's got that sort of space, he's unplayable. 